demonstrate you guys you can make this super fire chain glowing effect inside of after effects really easily and really quick to get started we have the big x the plug music video opened up here and we just have this one scene of his chain and the frame so what we're going to do to get started we're going to go down to our clip here and we're going to press Control d on it to duplicate it and then on the top one here you guys will see we have two of them we're going to double click on the top one we're going to click on a roto brush right here and we're going to start keying out the chain by drawing on it so you guys can see here all i'm doing is just clicking and dragging i'm sure you guys know how to rotoscope by now i have a couple tutorials on my channel explaining on how to do it now before we hop into this video the pre-order for fast effects is now available and i've given you guys a crazy deal if you add fast effects to your cart you can add two other editing packs to your cart that are under 40 dollars, and you'll get those two editing packs for completely free so if i add fast effects to my cart and then decide to add opium looks and crt textures i'll get crt textures and opium looks for completely free at checkout you guys don't want to miss out on this deal as it's not lasting forever go down below and pre-order fast effects today and it looks like we have a really rough cutout of this chain here i recommend you guys take more time with yours but for the sake of this tutorial i'm just going to cut it out super quick and we're going to go along here and just kind of play it through to see that there's no mess ups and everything looks good so we're going to go ahead and freeze this now so it's going to go ahead and pre-render this just so we don't have to do any more work or have it preload later on so going back into our composition here if we turn off the background layer you guys can see we have just the chain here and then and if we turn this on, we have him as well. So we're going to be working on just the chain. We're going to go ahead and open up our effects and presets. And to get started, we're going to be using something called Deeplow, which is a paid plugin, but I highly recommend you guys go ahead and grab it. If you don't have Deeplow, there's Native Glow and After Effects, there's Sapphire Glow, there's Universe Glow. There's a bunch of different glows that you guys can use to get a similar effect. So going ahead and dragging and dropping Deeplow on here, you guys can see we instantly get a really fire looking chain glow effect. You guys can tweak everything inside of your effect control settings to match it properly. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn the exposure down and tweak the source opacity as well. And you guys can see we have something just like this that looks super fire. Now to make it stand out even more, we're gonna go ahead and add a sapphire flicker, S underscore flicker. We're gonna drag and drop that on here. Now if we play it through, you guys can see we have this simple flicker effect. We wanna make it a little bit less. So we're gonna change this to 0.1 and change the random frequency to 100. And I think that looks good there, guys. Now we're gonna go ahead and look up something called glint and drag and drop that on there. You guys can see we get this really unique uh, like raise effect using this. So if we go into load preset here, there's a bunch of different ones that we could play with. I like the realistic glint right here, but there's a couple other ones that you guys can use. I'm gonna go ahead and load this one in here. You guys can see we kind of get like those bursts that show off a little bit more. You could even put the flicker below this. I think that looks fire there, guys. Even if you wanna go ahead and turn the flicker off as well, that works as that works just as well guys and you have the chain glowing a ton more if we go ahead and compare this to before and then after you guys can see it's a completely different looking chain here and that is pretty much it if you guys enjoyed this tutorial make sure to leave a like i'll see you guys in the next video tomorrow peace